Yo! What's poppin' YouTube? In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you five awesome glitches you can still do after the 1.51 update, okay? Now, before you say you got clickbaited, reread the title. It does not say five money glitches, five dupl car duplication glitches, five whatever you think this is. It's just five fun little glitches that you can do in the game still after the brand new update, okay? So for the first one, we're gonna come over here to this point on the map, all the way over here to the left. Uh, come to this little clothing store over here. Okay, well, you're gonna need something like that flies. You're gonna need an oppressor to do this pretty much. So once you get on your oppressor, I want you to just come over here to this building, like I said, and you're just gonna fly it right up here into this, this ceiling. So we're gonna just go up. Try not to do it too fast. Go up like that. And if you come over here to the end of this door, you can kind of go under the map. So uh, let me just... Yep, just like that. So if you go to the end of the store and hold R1, you can go all the way under the map. So you can get fully under the map with this glitch. Uh, it's pretty badass. And if you want to get out of the map, so you, um, I'm not in an online session right now, but you can actually lock onto people and kill them. And if you want to get out of the map, you can just go straight up. So I'm going to go ahead and show you right here. And you can just fly out of any part of the grass. I wouldn't fly into a building. You might get stuck, but there's some grass right here I'm about to fly out of. Hopefully it works. Sometimes it'll glitch out, but most of the time you should fly out just like this perfect all right let's go ahead and get into the next one so for this next one if you want me to be totally honest i think it's super super op um it's a wall breach okay it's going to be right here in the middle of the city most of you should know where this is let me just go ahead and put a marker on the map just so you know okay really close to uh this little penthouse the eclipse penthouse okay uh you're going to come up to this little cone towards the front of the building all right and like i said this is super op because of the location where it's at uh no one's going to be able to kill you with this all right so i'm gonna need you to pull out uh i recommend doing it with the ray gun but you can pretty much do it with any gun uh you're gonna click square and x to jump up into the jump up on top of this cone and you're gonna aim down sight so just aim down sight just like this once you get on top all right and you should just lag right into it so we're gonna jump up there we're gonna aim down sight and just like that, you can see through the cone, all right? So you're probably like, you know, this glitch is shitty. This big old cone's in my way. Nope. If you get into first person, look at this. Look at this. All the way see through. That's why I think this is so OP. Honestly, the location of it gives it gives it the most, you know, OP reward. Uh, it's definitely, definitely one of the best locations. Okay. So many people spawn right here. So many people are always griefing in this area. And it's so easy to get out of. Uh, nobody is going to be able to kill you. People are going to be like, how did he even do that? How did he get in there? And it's so simple. Uh, anybody can do this. So uh, if you just if you want to get out of this, you just can literally walk out and it's that easy. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get into the next one. So for this next one, it's another wall breach. It isn't as OP as the last one just because of the location, but the area of you walking around is way bigger, okay? So you're going to come to this position on the map. Okay, kind of like right here in the middle of the city. Uh, that's why it's not as OP. Most people will be over here chilling by Los Santos and things. And that lo that last wall breach we just did was right around this area. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna come down here in the middle of the city, right here next to this gas station and car wash. Okay, you're gonna find these little red railings. I think they're right across the street from the gas station, as you can see. The gas station's right over there to the left, right there. Come in this little uh, patch of grass. All right, and as you can tell, there's, there's this little balcony right here. You won't be able to get under this. All right, but what I want you to do is you're going to need the ray gun for this. Do the up and atomizer. I want you to back your head up to this this point right here. So put your head up against there, the back of your head. Put your head all the way up against it. Push your joystick back. Make sure you can't go back anymore. And then just go ahead and shoot this railing. As soon as you shoot this railing, your guy's going to get up. So he didn't do it right there. Let me try it one more time. It's very, very simple to do. Uh, just shoot the railing once again, and he should land on his back just like that. Or on his front side. If he lands on his front side... You can just walk into the building from here, and there is a big wall breach, okay? So you can pretty much walk out throughout this whole building. You can kind of explore a little bit. Uh, I'm not too sure how far this goes. I haven't really used this one before, uh, but I'm pretty sure that, the, you know, this goes all the way around the building. I have, Like I said, I haven't messed with this one. I do not know, like, if you can shoot through it, anything like that, but I do know that this is one of the biggest wall breaches in the game. Uh, you can pretty much run around the inside of this whole building. No one will be able to kill you. I'm not too sure. Here, let me test it. So I don't know where you can shoot out of this building, but I've seen someone do it before. I think there's certain spots to where you can. I don't know if it's like a window, a door. I'm not totally sure. If y'all figure it out, let me know down in the comments. But there is another wall breach for you. Let's go ahead and get into another one. 
So for this next one, it's kind of like a, more of a just a fun glitch. Uh, the last three you can kind of use to your advantage. This one, I just wanted to show y'all because I have no idea why this happens or why this works. Um, but you can just come to this point on the map over here on the beach. This little uh, body of shallow water, okay? Right over here by the pier. Uh, just get in this little body of shallow water. You can pull out an RPG, a harming launcher, the firework launcher, just any launcher that you have. I'm going to use the harming launcher for this one. And you can just aim it right down at your feet, make sure it's pointed down at your feet, and just shoot the weapon. And it will not kill you. Uh, it just flies off in different directions. Sometimes it'll go straight up. Uh, one time it did kill me, but mo for most of the time, they just shoot in all different directions. So you can kind of play around with this and see, uh, you know, if you can shoot some trick shots. You never know what you can do with this. But it, like I said, it works with any launcher. So let me rebuy my ammo real quick. My other launcher I'm going to show you here with the RPG. Uh, one second. Switch to your RPG. I don't have any fireworks, but you can use this also with the RPG. Just go ahead and show you once again. The RPG, for some reason, the RPG compared to the harming launcher seems to tweak out a little bit more. So as you can tell there, it I'm not too sure what it's doing, but they kind of like freak out. You you get no cops on you for doing this either. So once again, just a simple and easy fun glitch. Uh, let's go ahead and get into the next one. So for the number four spot, okay, you're going to need to get an SUV or any bigger vehicle. It doesn't have to be this exact one. And you're just going to want to come to this location on the map, okay? So really close to the pier, all right? Really, really close to the pier and the beach. From here, we're going to take the SUV and just back it up right here to this little green door, all right? Get out of the vehicle. We're just going to get on top of the car, and we're going to pretty much just jump onto this little AC vent. So keep clicking square, X, whatever platform you're on, and boom you will spawn in in uh, this little kind of under this little bridge uh, you will not be able to shoot out of this one that's the only that's the only bad thing about this one uh, you can definitely lock on to people but it will not let you shoot um, let me know if there is any way to shoot people I'm not too sure I've tried a bunch of different little spots in here sometimes there is little holes but uh, I'm pretty sure that this one is is non non breachable but if you want to go ahead and get out of this okay you can literally just walk right over here by this phone booth and it should let you out yeah right there perfect every single time you should be able to get let out so right there you can't go back in if you want to go back in you just go to the other side and jump on that ac vent okay so if you made it to the end of the video i appreciate you so much all right if any of these glitches were fun or they helped you out anything like that if you enjoyed the video please drop a like subscribe but for everybody who made it to the end of the video i'm going to be going ahead and showing y'all another glitch okay so i know that the title says five glitches but i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all six and let's go ahead and jump into it so for this one, it's another one of those, I don't know how this works type thing, but uh, you're going to come to this position on the map, okay? It's kind of on, in the middle of the highway, okay? Out here in the middle of nowhere. You're going to come over here to this little rock, all right? So whenever these little beams start to get close to each other, this little rock right here, you're going to get in first person, okay? I want you to back up a little bit. just seems to work a little bit better. You can literally hit trick shots, no scopes with this, uh, do a little montage, uh, do some Call of Duty shit on GTA. So from here, we're just going to literally spam X and keep running. And once you keep running, you can literally just, it, it launches you in the air. It doesn't work in third person for some reason, but whenever, like I said, whenever you just come over here and you just run into it, look at that. Like, it just, <laughs> it launches you straight up into the air. I think I can change it real quick. Hold on, let me see if I can change it to third person to show y'all. So hold on. Yeah, I can't change it. All right, I'm going to show you all one more time. So you just want to run into it, and then you launch up into the air. And it, it I don't understand why, but it kind of looks like you're running in midair. Like, there's nothing there, but you're still running up the stairs. So do it once again. It's crazy how this works. But yeah, man, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know if you like videos like this, and I will keep doing them. Just wanted to throw this out there since I can't do any glitches right now. But yeah, man, I hope y'all enjoyed, and I appreciate y'all watching. Peace.